was here in 2021. Joe Biden. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, everybody. <laughs> Women living in the suburbs, I keep hearing about the suburban woman doesn't like Trump. Well, I think it's a fake poll because why would they like me? I'm gonna, I keep the suburbs safe. I stopped low-income towers from rising right alongside of their house, and I'm keeping the illegal aliens away from the suburbs. I think that they like me a lot. I think it's a lot of fake polls. We've seen a lot of fake polls over the years. I was not supposed to. Women want to have safety. They want to have a strong military. They want to have a strong police force. They want to be in their house and they want to be safe. They don't want to be have people pouring into their doors and you can't do anything about it, right? I hope they like my personality. I have a nice personality. But to me, it wouldn't be very important, the personality. They want to be, uh, they want to be safe. And they want people like this happy and they want people like this taken care of properly because those are the people that keep them safe. So we'll shut down all deadly sanctuary cities throughout the country. Because all they do is they shield criminals. I mean, they basically shield criminals from prosecution. I will shift massive portions of federal law enforcement to immigration enforcement. We're going to put a lot of immigration enforcement. We're going to close down the border day one. Just so you understand, I am not a radical at all. I'm just a common sense person that was successful in what I did because of the same thing. And we want people to come into our country. A lot of people. We need them. We need them for jobs. We need them for everything. We want people to come in, but they have to come in through a process. They have to come in legally. And we can let a lot of them come in, but John, we want them to come in to our country legally. On day one, we will begin the largest domestic deportation operation in the history of our country. Big up every auto worker here will be out of a job within three years if I'm not elected. Every auto worker in this state, they're all gonna be made in China. They're going to an all-electric policy. Well, we have more liquid gold under our feet than any country in the world, but we don't have for what you need for an electric car. But China does, and its territories do, and uh, we're not going to let it happen. But they're building some of the biggest plants, and I have a friend who builds plants. He said some of the biggest in the world, I think he's doing them, are being built in Mexico. And they're going to sell cars produce them and sell them in this country with no tax. It's not going to happen. And I told them, I said, you better hope I don't win. Always dangerous to say these things. Maybe that's why I get shot at and other people don't. Right, John James? That's probably why I get shot at. Other people, they, they'll protect other people because they can't believe they got so lucky. But I have to do what I have to do. I have to do the right thing. We have criminals from all over the world pouring into our country right now. Your job will never be obsolete, you know? It will never be obsolete, unfortunately. It would be nice if we could have peace, but we're not going to have peace. And this is something we're going to have to live with for a long time. She has allowed millions of people, open border, to flow into our country totally unchecked, totally unvetted. And they come from jails and prisons, slightly different. They come from mental institutions all over the world. This isn't just... In South America, people think it's South America. It's from Africa, Asia, the Middle East. A lot of people coming from the Congo in Africa, the Congo. Rough, rough, rough. And they're uh, prisoners. They're prisoners. And we say, where do you come from, Africa? Where in Africa? Prison. What did you do? We don't want to say. You know, they like to talk. It's all nonsense. That Donald Trump stopped a bill. I was opposed to it, so was everyone else. It was the weakest bill. Under that bill, millions of people would have been allowed to come in. This was a weak bill. But you didn't need a bill. I didn't have a bill. I said, close the border. And that's how we got to those numbers, the lowest ever recorded. I said, close the border. I didn't have a bill. I didn't need a bill. She doesn't need a bill. Biden doesn't know where he is, so <laughs> where is he? Whatever happened to him? He got out. He got out. He's now... Sunbathing, he's in a beach someplace. But uh, all he would have to do as president or her is say, close up the border. And it's closed. But they don't want to close the border. Because when they first took over, I had built hundreds of miles of wall and I had 200 miles of wall in addition to what I said I was going to do because certain areas needed it. As we closed areas, other areas became... Uh, very, very strong in terms of people wanting to come through. So I bought 
200 additional miles. It would, would have taken him about three weeks to erect it. We we're all set to erect it. Then we had a terrible election take place, terrible election, as you and everybody here knows that. And uh, I realized that they don't want to do it. 